I, I don't have a lot of money. Don't go by my looks. <laughs> I wash this every evening for the next day. <laughs> Yeah, so I have limited money, like, uh, like I went to McDonald's recently. I took my order, the guy went, here is your order, sir, I hope you visit us again. I'm like, oh, McDonald's, uh, you don't have to say that. <laughs> I don't come here because you are amazing. No, my life is shitty. You know, I left college a decade ago, I still need you. <laughs> you know, if you really care, they should say the opposite, right? You know, here is your order, sir. I hope you never visit us again. In all my kindness, I go, dude, I hope the same for you. <laughs> and then he tries to top me, goes, sir, next time you visit us, I hope you have almost forgotten our menu. Which is a compliment because no rich person remembers McDonald's menu. You're looking for a life partner, don't look at interest, just ask the girl. Name five McDonald's dishes. <laughs> you know, along with their prices. <laughs> and if the girl is thinking first one is, nah, I can't marry you, you're high maintenance. Uh, <laughs> it's true. <laughs> If, if you don't remember Makalu Tiki, you can't be grounded in life. I have stories about McDonald's, man. I have graphs of their prices segregated by ear. I love it how you laugh on the phrasing of the sentences. It's highly uncommon in Gurgaon. Uh, <laughs> It's a good school I can make up. <laughs> <laughs>